Jubilee Party Secretary General Rafael Tuju is issuing a statement on the Wajir West by-election scheduled later this month on April the 25th. This comes in the wake of ODM's announcement to withdraw from the mini-poll in reciprocation of Jubilee's gesture in Ugenya and the Embakasi South by-elections last week. Jubilee did not field candidates in this constituencies. So let's just cross over to the Jubilee Party headquarters and listen in to the Secretary General. Time to time, when the leaders must appreciate the big picture beyond political contests and confrontation that add no real value beyond some bragging rights. Once again, we thank the ODM leadership for reading with us from the same script in this respect and their action of reciprocity with respect to Wajir West. We take this opportunity to appreciate the gesture of goodwill from Professor Mohammed Elmi Yusuf for standing down in favor of Mr. Ahmed Kolosh, who remains our candidate for the Wajir West constituency seat and nominee on Jubilee, on Jubilee party ticket, and who enjoys the full support of the party, the president, and the deputy president. That's the end of that statement, and I'm ready to take any questions if you want me to clarify anything. Yes, ah, there are no questions. We can go for lunch. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Uh, yes. Uh, who in particular was involved with the president, the DPO, the USSD, and from the other side of the ODM party was involved with um, We don't normally prosecute some of these things in the public domain, but it was consultations at the highest level of the two parties. All right, there you have it, the Jubilee Party Secretary General, Rafael Tuju, just given uh, the stand of Jubilee Party when it comes to the Wajir West by-election that is scheduled for April the 25th. Latest ODM pulled out from that particular race, citing um, they're just borrowing from the action by Jubilee to withdraw their candidates in the Ugenya and Embakasi South by-elections that took place last week. We'll definitely keep you updated, but let's take a short break right now as we release our views on KT and home but do stay tuned to K